Content Disarm and Reconstruction, CDR. This approach to security works by pulling files apart and putting them back together again. And the hope is that the file remains useful, but any bad bits like malware are thrown away in the process. This means that CDR solutions don't actually have to detect threats. They should neutralize them almost by ignoring them. To test CDR, SE Labs created a new type of test, the first we believe. We took legitimate files, the sort you want to have on your computer, and then we embedded threats inside them. Live threats that give attackers remote access to their targets. We hid our backdoors inside files like regular PDFs, Microsoft Office files and zip archives. Now at this point, certain different things could happen. In the worst case, the CDR solution would get rid of the useful parts of the file and keep the harmful parts. Or maybe some of the useful parts and get rid of some of the harmful parts too, but there's still a slightly broken file that's also a threat. Ideally, the solution removes the dangerous parts and leaves the useful file otherwise intact. Now you can see that this is a tough test to beat. Going to make no mistakes, lose the bad parts of the file, but completely maintain the parts that you want. So how did OpSWAT Deep CDR do in this test? Well, actually very well. It managed to completely remove all of the threats and didn't corrupt any of the useful files, which is an excellent performance. And it's great to see companies like OpSWAT putting their technologies up for review.